a bit of a bad road and bust the front suspension off. Top arm snap, and they'll fix this. Beautiful job for them. And what is your name? Mubakarlo. This man wants to go to university in England. He's been very helpful. He's a real good fella. We're going to try and help him as best we can. Oh, look at disco bye, bye, welding bye, bye, garage. Bye, bye. Very cool. What's it do? Whose fault is it that my car broke? Yes, it is. School to drop off, a load of football shirts for their football team. Been easy to post them, but here we are. Welcome. Ah, okay. Uh, the president of the Senegal uh, has come to school here. Ah, right, cool. Oh, really? Okay. Louis. And there's Bamako. Yeah. Got it? Oh yeah, shit, it's a long way, isn't it? Yeah. Oh yeah. So yesterday we went from there to here, to yep. Makumba. Today we're just going from there to there, but we've got to get through the border. Yep. We've got a shit road. And then tomorrow we go there to there. Alright. Sounds good. Alright. You got the easy drive again. Yeah. That's gonna be a long one, isn't it? Yeah, that's a I reckon that's a nine hour shit. Oh, oh, geez, and then some, yes. yes. Is a bit of an issue today on this road. It's a bit Necessity today because this is our view. Oh, yeah. Total dust, it's horrible. You got it, Wayne? There it is. There we go. Donate that to the Grass Verge Fund. Yeah. No ball, some guard. Here a second, let's have a picture of it. He's deaf as a post, you have to shout out. That was a load of dust, couldn't see anything, took off, landed, and it's just snapped that thing again to the steering. It's well out. We're in the middle of nowhere, so we'll have to keep bobbing on. Hope it holds in there and try and get it welded somewhere else. Well, the front suspension snapped again. As you can see, the steering is all over the shop. You've got about a quarter turn either way before it actually does anything. Wayne's coping very well, but he did break it by jumping an invisible speed hub. No, I didn't see it, it was one of those. So we're going to struggle on, the steering's kind of pointing in, which quite badly, but uh, 140 k's get to the border. Once we get to Mali, it doesn't matter, we leave the car and give it to something. That's broken. <laughs> we'll break again and we'll weld it again. Hopefully. Lovely place. <laughs> somebody's, got, somebody's got to film it. <laughs> <laughs> The roads are getting worse, if that's possible. Got a little left of the road there is. We've had the suspension smashed a bit again today and repaired again today. They've done a pretty good job. 
And it doesn't matter how you overtake trucks, as long as you get past it. And he's just come around the inside of him, into a hedge. We're going to try the outside, I think. That's have another. Clear, go. Looks pretty clear. We're not going down that one. a couple of deaths from some of the crashes we've seen and it's still going on. This is meant to be about a two and a half hour trip. I think it'll be like seven hours. So today's been another solid day of the, oh my God, most ridiculous potholes and naked roads you've ever seen. It's, it's just, I can't describe how incredibly bad it's been. Suspension snapped, had that fixed. It should have snapped again, but it hasn't. It's amazing. Uh, but yeah, the roads are just shocking, absolutely shocking. So we just drive the side. Well, it should have been a two hour journey to turn into an eight hour extravaganza. But it's quite enjoyable anyway, you like yeah, it? Yeah. Yeah. seems quite attractive. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we're going to keep going because we're slow. Yeah, that's alright. You're hitting the ground as much as we are. No. no. <laughs> we're hitting the roof. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it is unbelievable. Yeah. It's monkeys. Pothole monkeys. Yeah. 